just how stressful it is to, to be on the sideline with the game on the line and, and to see your offense take the field? It's, it's a terrible feeling just <laughs> not having any control over it, but uh, I definitely have faith in Kyle and everybody on our offense to get it done. And we needed a win like that, I feel like. Well, why, why, do you, why do you feel like you needed a win? We just haven't come from behind in a while. Um, it's a really good team and uh, really good coaching, and uh, you know, just helps you get more battle tested. How would you say your performance? Mine? Yeah. Uh, I think. I mean, it was it was a grind. I, I think I left everything out there, and uh, I was getting getting to the quarterback a little bit. He was getting rid of it. There was a lot of chips. Didn't really get into the game that we wanted to play as a D line. Um, wanted to get some points and, and kind of have a lead there to, to really get after him. But he was getting rid of it, and he's a really good quarterback. So. Were you among those screaming at Greg Newmont to get down? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I took my helmet off. <laughs> Nick, what's it going to mean for you guys to host the NFC title game? Third time in three years, but the first time since 2019 it'll be here in front of the baseball. It's going to be awesome. We love love the faithful, love the energy in the stadium, and uh, just enjoy this for a very short period of time. I think we're going to have an extra day to get get right and um, come out and play a lot cleaner. How much so was a character win for you guys? I mean, you guys haven't had too many games like this. To, you know. Yeah, like I said, we need, we needed that. Did, did you guys have to make some quick changes, or did you uh, at halftime or anything to make some? I didn't. No. Um, I wasn't slipping. You said the team needed, do you think Brock kind of needed a win like this? Like yeah, I feel like it's all learning, learning experiences. And um, I think the offense and, and the defense made a lot of mistakes um, that we need to clean up if we want to win. Nick, do you feel like the defense is well this season and containing mobile quarterbacks? Uh, yeah, yeah, we've, we've had a, a lot of, uh, a lot of experience against it. Um, Love wasn't quite as much of a threat in that department as some of the other guys we played, but um, but it's the way the league's going. So you guys did have a, a lot of mistakes, some, some busts in coverage. Does does that surprise you that at this stage of the season you're have you're having some of those? Uh, issues? You know, it's it's tough. It's it's good coaching. I think a lot of the the. Uh, the plays they ran were kind of saved for us, not saved for us, but new, um, not on tape. And uh, you're playing really good teams this time of year, but we definitely need to uh, hone in on the details and, and improve. Nick, that final play where Dre gets the interception, you got pressure there. You just got to take us through your viewpoint of what you saw and then were you screaming for him to get down as well? Yeah, it, it was a game we ran and uh, I kind of got caught up with the guard and the tackle inside. Eric was wrapping, but they kept the chipper in so he couldn't wrap and get pressure. And I saw him break, and I was out of there. Go hit him. Not too much celebration, but uh, I'll probably watch it just to see what happened. I like to watch it after. Um, yeah. Nick, is the feeling after this one more relief than anything else? Yeah, it was for sure. I mean, just this group that we have, I did not want this to end, and nobody did, and um, we made the plays we needed to. Beer doesn't doesn't really do it for me anymore. Maybe something else. All right, Nick.